this protection system to augment the entire operation? Um, we have inherited uh, many problems with the whole um, criminal justice system. It can't be fixed overnight. It requires uh, um, a multifaceted approach that requires resources, logistical, technical, um, logistical capabilities, and a host of other things. Um, I think the police service has been doing a tremendous job um, during the state of emergency. Um, we support them in what they are doing, and we know that this um, front page story with the men who are released and the cries that are coming out, um, we know that that conversation will change when people look at the CCTV footage and see what these good gentlemen have been up to. Um, and that is just a tip of the iceberg. We have rapes that have been committed in those areas, and the victims who have been raped are seeking counseling, but they do not wish to cooperate to see but once again, that they have been raped. Once again, with all due respect, uh, Attorney General, uh, the fact that the juxtaposition of those 21 being released and this footage being shown now, people are going to ask the question, well, if you have footage of people committing crimes and, and you're seeing people released, there may be this opposition that, well, these people are involved here. Why not then have the systems in place through the police to collect evidence based on the fact that we have a history of witnesses not coming forward? And, and, and the answer to that, sir, is simply that the police can only do so much. Um, if you have people who are terrified and they are not prepared to speak or stand up in court, then no matter how, there's no other way to gather evidence because you cannot have a crime without a victim in 90% of criminal offenses. The Prime Minister if indicated you, if, that... If you filmed, if, you filmed, if, I, if I captured um, footage of someone being raped, unless the young lady is prepared to come to court to say I was being raped or I was a victim of rape and I did not consent, there is absolutely nothing we can do with the footage. The Prime Minister indicated that we should not focus only on the gang-related activity, given the fact that of the 2,000 or so detained or arrested so far, 